So bored I was that day, as I watched the other kids play. And all I could think of to myself was, how come I could not play in the same carefree way? But amidst my dark thoughts, was it them? Was it me? And why? Did the restless wondering of my eyes stop when I saw the butterfly? At first I pitied the thing and willed it to fly away free, but it had hardly moved. And I thought to myself, why should it be free and not me? So I put it under a glass and peered deep within its soul. Was it happy? Did it feel? And that's when I saw the one thing I fear the most, a horror so vast, so raw, so real, the secrets of the butterfly haunted me all through the night as if all the pains of the world had been caught within its sight. How could something seem so beautiful, so delicate, so frail, yet very deep within its gaze, all my fears prevail. The next day I ran out to the other kids and told them of my dreams. They laughed and made a game of it. And before I knew it, it seemed that I too was now playing without a care in the world, screaming and laughing and such. And the horror of the butterfly, well, didn't bother me so much. <laughs>